I have a nurse on the left and uh, my PA on the right. And the nurse on the left is going to identify that pocket of uh, HA. And we're using a cannula here. Keep in mind that actually, I tried injecting this blindly with hyaluronidase and there was no difference in the pocket. Uh, again, I think sometimes these form a little cyst or a pseudocyst and there's a little wall around them. And that's why I think that some people come to me and they say they've been injected four or five, six times and they still have this nodule or, or swelling uh, related to their prior HA. So you can see that we are actually within the pocket. You, you can see the needle right here. I'm, I'm sorry, the cannula right here. And she's injecting as we speak. And you see almost resolution of that nodule uh, before our very eyes. There's another and one. This that doesn't she, need to be a two person procedure, right? Like you could, you do this by yourself, one hand, one hand on each, one on the probe, one on the needle. You can do it. It's, if you have an assistance, it's probably a little easier, but you can mm -hmm. do it um, because you're holding it and you're, you're trying not to move and you're looking up at the screen. And so it, it's possible, but um, I learned from my radiology colleagues that uh, when they, they're doing stuff, they're, they're using um, an assistant too. The, there is an enhancement to get needle enhancement, which makes the needle or the cannula even better visualized. But in this case, I, I wasn't using that and you can still see it pretty well. Um, so, and keep in mind that uh, these are a lot smaller than you're used to, Oren, as well. This is a 27, yeah. it's 27 gauge, so uh, it's pretty small. And it yeah, actually, I'm definitely not used to seeing a 27 gauge needle on the ultrasound. You know, that's kind of a blind procedure for me. So right, <laughs> and keep in mind that this was basically painless. There was a little bit of um, lidocaine added 